find the ratio in which the line x minus 3y equals 0 divides the line segment joining the points minus 2 comma minus 5 and 6 comma 3. See here a line segment AB if we will take it as A and B A minus 2 comma minus 5 and B 6 comma 3. Okay, and this line is divided by the line AB is divided by the line X minus 3Y. So this line is X minus 3Y equals 0. So here this point, so I will try to find the point which is common for this both. Then I will substitute this point in X minus 3Y to get the ratio. So let the ratio be M1, M2. So now I will find the point. So here this one see X1, Y1 x2 y2 so formula section formula is m1 x2 plus m2 x1 by m1 plus m2 m1 y2 plus m2 y1 by m1 plus m2 so if i'll substitute the values m1 x2 is 6 m2 x1 is minus 2 by m1 plus m2 here m1 y2 value is 3 here y2 is 3 and y1 is minus 5 m2 into y1 which is minus 5 by m1 plus m2 and if we we'll simpli simplify next time 6 times m1 minus 2 times m2 by m1 plus m2 3 times m1 minus 5 times m2 by m1 plus m2. Now this is the point which like common for both AB and the line x minus 3y equals 0. So this point I will substitute in the line. So the line is x minus 3y equals 0. So here there is no constant. So you can write this line as x equals 3y. Then if you will write in this way there is no need of taking LCM directly you can cancel the denominators I will show now. So this value is x and this value is y. So substitute 6 times m1 minus 2 m2 by m1 plus m2. 3 times y. y is 3 times m1 5 times m2 by m1 plus m2. So now see here in the denominators m1 plus m2 we can cancel. Now the further simplification 6 times m1 minus 2 m2 3 times 3 9 m1 minus 3 times 5 15 m2 now bring the like terms towards one side 6 m1 minus 9 m1 equals minus 15 m2 if we'll send this towards right side plus 2 m2 so the next step here 6m1 minus 9m1 is minus 3m1 minus 15m2 plus 2m2 is minus 13m2 minus and minus will get cancelled so we need to find m1 by m2 which is nothing but 13 by 3 therefore the ratio is m1 is to m2 is 13 by 3 Okay, and see if we got the ratio 13 is to 3, 13 is to 3. Now, we need to find the point also. So, now we need to substitute this M1, M2 values in this equation. So, if we will substitute here, because find the ratio is one part and the next part is here, if you will see, find the coordinates of the point of intersection. So, find the coordinates of the point of intersection. So, P equals m1 is 13 so 6 into 13 minus 2 into 3 by 13 plus 3 3 times 13 minus 5 times 3 by 13 plus 3 so if you calculate further 16 times 13 sorry 6 times 13 60 8, 18 78 2 times 3 is 6 by 
16. Here 3 times 13 is 39. 5 times 3 is 15 by 16. So if you we'll calculate further here, I'll write here P, the point 78 minus 6 is 72, 72 by 16. So next one is 39 minus 15. So 39 minus 15 is 24. 24 by 16. So if you cancel this, 8 times 2, 8 times 3. Here, 8 times 2, 8 times 9. So the point is 9 by 2, 3 by 2. Or you can write 4.5, 1.5. So the point of intersection is 4.5, 1.5 and the ratio is 13 is to 3.